Hey, what's up guys? I thought I would uh, make a video showing the progress on the uh, laser uh, tube cutting machine. Uh, you can see the bed of it here and the chuck in the front and the support chuck here on the back. Or I guess the back of it back there would be the... Uh... Well, anyway, you get the idea. It, it supports a tube in there and we got a laser to uh, put in there with it. But one of the things that I'm trying to connect is this thing has um, three phase 380 volt servo um, and so they included in this a um, transformer that takes three phase um, 380 I'm sorry it takes three phase 240 into three phase 380 and um, this is the hookup for it right here so I'm guessing that my three phase uh, wires will go right there uh, on the input coming from my breaker. And then these three phase wires here that are 380 are the output. And you can see they've got knockouts to come into the box and knockouts to go out. Um, the real question is, is this N and PE? So the PE looks like ground. You can see it's a small green wire. So I'm guessing that's ground. And N, I guess, is a neutral. But I don't have a neutral on my three phase. Uh, now, single phase, you know, obviously there's a neutral bus here. Um, so this is like a normal three phase, one of my three phase breakers right here. You know, you can see I got three uh, hot leads coming uh, out of that. And of course, I got the ground bus here. You know, you can see some pretty big ground wires in there, uh, some small ones as well. So, um, and then, you know, this is, you see the white ones there. This is going to be neutral. So, you know, I thought the neutral was only for single phase, but you guys tell me. I've been working with my contacts over there, and this is one of the drawbacks to, you know, importing a machine directly from the manufacturer in China uh versus you know a machine made in america but i can't afford one that's made in america you know i i, it, I probably never would be able to so i'm kind of muddling through this and hopefully some of you guys will have some thoughts on this and it also has this power conditioner um so you, you got this transformer and the power conditioner to make this suitable to where it'll run the run the servos so it's out of the breaker into the transformer into the power conditioner and then into the actual uh, machine and you can see the harness on it up there so uh, and the you know the the uh, control cabinet over there that runs it so um, we're getting there we're getting there so uh, leave a comment um, and if you have any information on this uh, let me know um, I'd appreciate it